Is this fine? This, yep, this is fine. just arrived in Cincinnati just got to my room I grabbed my camera real quick I'm like let me start the narrative let me start blogging but I thought it was kind of sweet how they had like some nice music playing here it's actually perfect for my mood right now this is me look at me I look so tired oh man everybody was complimenting this coat on the plane and stuff I was like, all right. But anyway, and then it looks like they have some products here for us, a gift bag, and then a bunch of the feminine care stuff. I'm gonna look in this bag real quick just to see what's popping. Oh, wow, looks like some girl power type stuff. Looks like some athletic wear. Yeah, like a water bottle. Some stiff. Looks like a, what is this? A diffuser? Okay, so yeah, just like some cool feminine stuff. V for Vaughn, that's so cute. Still got my wireless beats in my ear. Man, I needed to have taken those out a long time ago. I feel like I can hear so much better now. It's about 10.30 p.m. or if not a little later, Eastern time. So I don't know, for some reason I'm just really tired. Like I tried to sleep in today and everything, but I'm still really, really tired. I didn't get enough rest, so. So this is Hotel Covington, by the way. And I'm gonna go ahead and turn this heat up right now because I already know this is not going to be warm enough for me. I need at least 76. Or I won't be able to get comfortable. My plain look, it's black Nike leggings and this Nike sweatshirt with pockets. And then I got these Nikes. Um, they're just trainers. Like this whole top part is stretchy and flexible and it's super comfy. It just feels like I'm wearing socks with reinforced bottoms. The waste basket looks like a shopping bag, but you guys, this is a garbage can. It's like a metal garbage can. That is really cute. My hair is just in like a bun. I'll probably do like a wash and go in the morning. I'm here with the Procter & Gamble team. Um, I kind of hinted at it in one of my other videos, but I'm working on another project with the brand. I'm already doing what you guys know about with Pampers. So this is something a little bit different with their feminine care product offerings. So I can't give you all the details at this moment, but you will know before the end of this vlog what all of this was all about. So, so I'm looking forward to tomorrow, learning all about the new product launches and being able to see some of the archives at the PNG headquarters. I've been kind of looking forward to doing that. We didn't get to do that last time we were here. So jam packed schedule tomorrow. I mean, it's airtight. I don't know, my energy is just kind of low right now. You guys can probably tell. I'm just really tired. Like once I get a good nice rest, I think I'll be okay. You guys, I just finished polishing my nails this color. It's an Ella and Mila uh, polish. It's called Sun Kissed. And I believe these polishes, I have a couple of these. I recently discovered them. I think they're like vegan, cruelty free, know this, know that type of product. But I tried it out because um, the color looked fun and it actually looks really good on. So these are pretty awesome. All right guys, it's the next morning. And I just wanted to show you my outfit before I head down for the welcome breakfast. <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> so this is my hair. I just did a wash and go with my little uh, flexi rod cheek code thing that I showed you guys before. So that's kind of where we are. Um, my hair was not completely dry with the flexi rods, but I'm just making it work. I mean, it's pretty dry now. It's pretty dry now, but it's just like, it probably needs like another 20 minutes. And this is my outfit. I just kept it real simple today. Um, yeah, so just like this striped shirt that I've had for like 
20 years um not literally and this um blazer that i got from zara a while back some fashion nova jeans and these they're thigh high boots but i just pushed them down a little bit but if i bring them all the way up they'll be like you know all the way up to the thigh but i just kind of pushed them down just a little bit um because it's a little too much black just need a little more blue that's the look and i just got my bag here I'm gonna be carrying because I needed the space this time, so I bought, brought out the big boy. I'm not bringing my laptop. I'm just gonna put my ring back on. I took it off because the jeweler told me, like, look, if you want to preserve this thing properly and not have stones fall out and blah blah blah, you need to um, take it off often and don't like put lotion and stuff on it and don't get in the shower with it and like all these rules and stuff. So I'm trying to stick to it. Hopefully, I don't lose the thing. All right, I'm gonna head downstairs. I'm really loving this polish, you guys. Morning. Just finished breakfast. It was really nice. They had lots of vegan options. So now we're just heading out into the lobby area and waiting for our ride. It was cute during breakfast. There was a little icebreaker where we were all talking about like our most memorable period stories and it was some funny stuff being spewed, I'm telling you. We don't even have coats. We don't even, I just but we're, we're gonna go right into the bus. I, just, I literally just have to change into pants because I just wear it. the media company or something like that because everybody's got <laughs> Welcome aboard, Thank you. More party bus action. All right. Let's get in here. Oh, good morning. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hi. Well, we it first. And then we were like, you guys are so fancy. Oh, my God. Look, you guys, it's Tony. <laughs> <laughs> oh, your nails are cute. Thank you. These are my real nails. Oh, they are? Mm -hmm. Nothing on it? It's the or just dip. the lint? Oh. So, I just blew my nails out that way. Oh. the early stuff this is super cool it's like a museum I'm already like obsessed with consumer products from this era when we were still trying to figure out the things that we needed we've come such a long way just as human beings <laughs> Under the sun. What a wonderful sight when your wash is done. The cleanest clean under the sun is tide clean. You tide clean. Oh, 
Oh, she's eight. Um, so, she got an eight. Oh, so, yeah. uh, yeah. Really? So weird. I think my daughter's gonna be taller than me too. How cute. I need to take one of these chairs with me. We got into the party bus this morning. The guy was like, this is definitely a media trip, right? Because we all want <laughs> like everyone's got cameras. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Got a salad with some balsamic vinaigrette dressing. Um, and what this does is it helps it stay very securely closed. And not all of our competitive products have this little take. An hour is rare. It's just what we, that's one of those things. In the water, you can practice oh, super easy. Stuff. And imagine if you were walking with that. Yeah, you're kind of. Ooh. Insertion and removal comfort. So kind of stick your finger down. Back in my hotel room, playing off my makeup. Yeah. So dinner was good. Um, they had plenty of vegan options for us plant-based ladies, so that was really nice. I actually sat down next to one of the scientists responsible for the herbal essences formulations, and that was a really fun conversation. Like, and we weren't even just talking about PNG stuff; we were talking about like mom stuff, wife stuff, that kind of thing. So that was super cool. And I got to talk with like the director of influencer marketing stuff, and got to talk with the folks from the Pampers Pure category, and it was just really nice to just kind of connect and then with some people reconnect so the dinner was really nice it was more of like a networking it was more of like learning about the png brands because every course of dinner correlated with one of the brands so each of the managers from those categories were there and they kind of stood up in between courses and talked to us about whatever product they were responsible for and then they kind of tied it into what the course was that we were eating so it was really really fun and thoughtful and creative like i love stuff like that like when stuff like that starts to happen, I'm just sitting there smiling like, you guys are so creative. Like, I, creatives gravitate towards creatives, and I just love stuff like that. Yeah, so I'm going to hop in the shower real quick, and, uh, and I'll be going to bed, so nighty night. <laughs> Good morning. Okay. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Hi. Good. Nice to meet you, Melissa. I'm Vaughn. Wi-Fi? 
I guess yeah, on my yes. camera too. I'm just not even sure where it is. So. Yeah, I don't like how they have a I can this way group of women. You. Okay. I thought I'd fix it. So my theme from here is really cool. Look at this. Turn that out. So cute. cute. Oh, well, that. Yeah, I like that. I just love how wide the house is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go get a beret. Yes. Oh. <laughs> All right, guys. Hey, so I'm sitting here with one of the scientists. Her name is Barbara. Uh, she's on the Tampax Pure and Clean line, and she's been with PNG for about 21 years. So I am so excited and a little bit intimidated to be sitting next to a scientist. But what we're gonna do? What we're gonna do is a quick little experiment just to kind of show you guys how these products work and why they are superior to the leading brand. So she's gonna walk me through how to do this, so I'm gonna kind of be like doing some scientific stuff today. Okay. <laughs> so what we do is that typically we prepare some syringes Okay. water. This is water. Okay. But water just, with some green food coloring. Yes, it okay. can apply what we're going to to have in our bodies, but it's for the, the sense of the experiment we're going to do here. Okay. So you're going to drop a few. Drop. Um, this is the Tampax Pure, Pure and Clean, and clean. Tampax. okay, and then this is the leading is, competitor. Yes. Okay, so we're just going to drop some colored oh, water right sorry. on top. Yeah. As it will absorb all the fluids that are around. And what happens is that you start seeing that there are some open areas with the deep competitors going around the vaginal walls. Okay, you guys, you can kind of see, sorry, I'm using my vlog camera, so it's not the best quality, but I just wanted to show you guys how, like, this is the Tampax Pure and Clean one and how it's kind of expand it to really like cut off that drip right so that nothing can get through and then you kind of see over here with the leading competitor that you know your period fluid can get through because this thing doesn't expand as much and I just don't I don't even like the shape of it because it doesn't even it's not even designed to expand in a way that will be effective there is one other thing I wanted to show you and is that we have a built-in lead guard braid that in case is a backup support here so you see that even extra fluids could go through that, avoiding soiling, okay? With others, is that typically the fluid can go around your, the braids and drop directly. Yeah, and that's going all in your underwear, in your, your underwear. thong, that's getting everywhere. So we're just doing the same experiment with the pads, you guys, just kind of showing the protection, the leak protection and stuff. So we're applying the same liquids from earlier onto these pads. And I think what's cool about this, and Barbara can probably explain a little bit better, is that when the liquid is distributed into the always pure and clean pad, it kind of like disperses itself and doesn't like mm -hmm. all build up in that one spot. So like when you're sitting down and your legs are folded or are crossed, you don't have like that bunching going on with the fabric and everything. Yes, and the other thing that you are going to see here is that we have a unique technology in our cover that will let the fluid get in, but it will not let let it to get out, okay? So we're going to see that right away as soon as we put some filter paper on top of each one of them, okay? And we're going to do this little experiment here. And you can see how come you will see what happens when always pure and clean will keep you drier than any other pad with less ingredients. So thank you so much, Barbara, for demonstrating that to us. That was very helpful. I appreciate it. Thank you for inviting me. Thanks. I don't know what that's called. Oh, yeah. I've never seen that before. You guys, I'm, me and Tony are back here looking at um, know, the cute, like, backyard. backyard. Now, this one could use a little work. Yeah. We're not saying it's perfect, but over here, look at this. This is almost it's like, really beautiful. It's like a Tibetan getaway or something. Look, they got the little Buddha head over there. It's so cute. They have the little gazing ball back up in there. I mean, this gives me like, am I tripping? Asian. Something Asian, for the sure. Leaves. Yeah. So that's whatever. that's definitely what they're going for. I don't know if these are all like rental properties or what, but yeah, it's nice. It's Guys, a cute little backyard. It's a beautiful house. <laughs> <laughs> they for said sure. they said Zach Afron was here right before we got here. What? They had rented the place, so they were trying to do a walkthrough, uh -huh. and they couldn't because he was here. And they were like, "Nope, you definitely can't go there because there's a celebrity there." And they told her who what? it was. Yeah, tripped out. What? Mm-hmm. Look at Tony, y'all. <laughs> she is just goes dripping with goes. <laughs> 
And I put on the same stuff I had when I came here. I was like, look. Okay, I liked it. It was comfortable. I'm putting it back on. Because I'll probably leave in the morning on Sunday. We can't So cute. So there's this room. All of the rooms are themed. I don't know if I mentioned that, but all the different products under the Tampax brand and all of the ones under the Always brand, each room is kind of themed after that, and I think that's so cute. This is the pure and clean room. And so I was taking pictures and stuff in the rooms just to, you know, have some cute little content to share. I mean, why not? We're here. I really love these new um, tampons and pads, you guys. I am definitely making the switch 100% and it has nothing to do with, you know, any kind of sponsorship or any of that kind of stuff. Because when I do this kind of stuff, I don't have to fully subscribe to products if I don't want to. Um... And I don't feel like I'm being dishonest when I don't because it's more of one of those things where it's like I'm trying it, I'm giving my opinion, and I'm moving on. But sometimes I come across products where I'm actually legit like, oh, wait, I want this to replace what I used before I used this. So this is definitely one of those products. Mm -hmm. 